James the intern. James the intern. James the intern. And hello! hello. <laughs> so, that was not rehearsed at the, all. Not rehearsed at the all. At all. Um, we are here at Priscilla, Queen of the Desert. It is me, James the Intern, and Ellen Marsh. James the Intern. I liked your song. I saw it. It was Thanks. good. It was and fun. I like all your like action shots. Um, that was exciting. That was fun. It was a fun day. I got some odd looks. I have no action shots. We'll get you an action shot. Mm. Yes! Action. Okay. I'm gonna make that the like little the freeze. The freeze. <laughs> done and done. Done and done. <laughs> Hi James. Hey, how you doing? Good, how are you? So last time we saw you on Spotted, you were eating like a giant cupcake. And what of it? And what of it? Whatever. Sometimes you need a cupcake. <laughs> how do you keep your shapely figure <laughs> with all these little drag queen boys running around? They're so bitchy. Oh. <laughs> you heard it. Um, you heard it. No, seriously. I always say, what did I tell you the other day? That they eat cotton I, and their emotions. Yes, it's cotton and their emotions. They just eat their emotions. The Broadway diet. It's, it's whatever. Yeah. They actually have it on the menu at Westway. <laughs> Broadway diet. Cotton balls and emotions. And someone comes and like insults you so you could like feel bad about yourself. <laughs> yeah. It's awesome. But they insult you in a foreign language. <laughs> so you don't even know what they're insulting you Yeah, they're like Greek about. or something there, yeah, right? they're intense. Um, I don't work out. I mean, I do the show and I have a two and a half year old. Like, so no, that is your workout? Yeah, I like clean up toys. I bend down all day cleaning up toys. And then I sing and dance in a harness. So it's like... In a harness, y'all. Yeah. Who needs Spider-Man? We have Priscilla. Seriously. It is no joke at Priscilla. Backwards and in heels. Backwards and in heels. Ginger Rogers is, is proud of the show. I know. She I feel like she's looking down. <laughs> <laughs> looking down and judging. Looking down. And <laughs> <laughs> but Bette Midler's looking up. I'm coming for you. Seriously. Ooh, we'll have to edit that out. Edit? Maybe not. You can't. We can't Maybe insult Bette. No, we Bette's awesome. Bette. Oh. Have you met Bette? Yeah, we met her a couple of times. She's tiny. Is she really? She's like weensy. She's the weensiest little thing. But she's very sweet. And, I mean, she's a divine Miss M, so she knows, like, what's up. You, know? you can't she's, get much better than Bette. Seriously, Bette. she's been around for, like, 72 and a half years. Something like that. 72 and a half. Point <laughs> <laughs> five. She's awesome. But we're, yeah. So she loved our show and, and was like dying to like be a part of it. So. Well, how could she not? I know, right? It's so fun. It's so her. It is so her. She I, did want to clean it up a little bit for Broadway. And that was, a lot of people have like commented about like who've seen it in the West End, how it was cleaned up for Broadway, a couple of the if bombs. Yeah, you're talking about cleaning up, you're talking about a little bit of the raunchiness yeah. was taken out. Yeah, a lot of people like, some people were like, a, not offended, but they felt like pandered to, you know, because they're like, we can handle if bombs. <laughs> That's coming from a mother as well, <laughs> by the way. I can handle an F bomb. And we're actually sitting in her dressing room my dressing at the room. palace. It's... You can't see, but it goes, like, how many feet, James? Like, oh, at least 20. Yeah, 20. I was going to say, like, 30. But, but yeah, probably yeah, say between be 20 and 30. It goes, like, really far that and way. And at least 15 this way. Yeah. It's, it's huge. It's huge. It is the deluxe room. The, the, yeah, this is my this is my space. You know, mirror. Oh, my um, Eva lashes. Those aren't even eyelashes. Those they're, are, like, they're, like. Those are hair extensions. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is insane. Those are so huge. And my super swing pillow. For those of you who don't know, Miss Ellen swings the show. Mm -hmm. um, how many tracks are you doing in Priscilla? Um, I do six tracks, which include the three divas and then the three characters. There's only six women in the show. So there's the three divas. Women. <laughs> wink, wink. But we, I do play men, too. I, I have played men and the boys have played girls. Not divas or any principals, but... Um, so I play the three divas, and then I cover the three character ladies, which, for those of you who haven't seen, are um, Asian male order bride, um, a, like, white trashy bar mistress, is that what you call, what do you call it? a barmaid, bar a bar Perhaps. wench, a and then um, a mom, the little boy's mom, so it's the three characters and then the divas, so... And how is it understanding the divas, because that's three separate harmonies, is that hard to keep track of? How do you yes. keep that in your mind? <laughs> um, well, I've been doing the show for a year and a half now, just to tell you how hard it is, and I just messed up the other day. I was <laughs> singing up in the flies. We sing 
every all the background vocals are live in the show. So anytime you hear anyone singing in the background, it's all us changing our clothes or hanging. You have in to the sing air. while you change. Oh yeah, we're like I just <laughs> walk away. So, it's pretty funny. I always say they should sell a back a back seat backstage so that people can see what happens back there. Maybe we can do that with Broadway Spotted. I mean, for a lot of money. But it's good for a lot of Maybe money. we can do it for BCFA for like Broadway Spotted. Right? Like Seriously, charity. like just one chair and everyone can see it is utter mayhem. I mean, you're dealing with costume, makeup, gender changes. I mean, people changing gender right in front of you. And um, it's a really, really heavily intense vocal show. And um, our music director, Spud Murphy, is um, really adamant about keeping the vocal quality every person in the show is a massive singer um in addition to doing their specialty you know like for example Kayala who plays the bar wench I like that um she has no solos and that girl can like wail like you would not believe but it's six girls holding down the show so So you have to um, have a very strong female presence totally yeah so um so yeah so it's just mayhem back there so I always said that if there was just one seat People would see a totally different show, and it would be so fun. I think we should. I think we should auction it off. I think we should auction it off. Well, that'd we could do it at the Broadway flea market. That'd be amazing for like a million dollars. One million dollars. Um, but yes, it is. Going back to your question, it is um, really hard to keep the harmonies together because all six girls sing different harmonies at different times. Which is a lot of harmony. Yeah. I remember <laughs> for one song. Um, and it's. So, for example, someone will be on the top on this song, but the middle on the next song, and the middle on that song, but then the top. So you just kind of now, of course. That is a braid. Yeah. (laughs) Do you have to chart it out? Or you've been in it for a year and a half now. How is it jumping into that? Um, Well, it's crazy. Everyone has... um, Oh, I have my book down here. Everyone has their different um, techniques, and I... Um, I'd only swung a play before, and I'd never swung a musical. Um, So everyone has a different method to do it. Um, some people have charts. I have every every girl is a different color, and I actually have the choreography um, written out. So I'll show. Let's see, these are the different. Can harmonies. you just show the camera, maybe? Yeah. This so like, if I'm on for Stacy, that's how I keep track of her harmonies. Obviously, I don't have to now, but in the beginning, and um, so like this will be, "Don't Leave Me This Way," which is the funeral. That's sort of how I mapped it out. And everyone has numbers, and that's how I can follow it. So if I go on for any one girl, they each have a tab. And I, um, you know, Stacy's yellow, Jaylene's blue, um, Kayala's red, and I just go to their show. So I have six shows um, in this book. Everyone has their own show, so their whole tab. And then and they're, they're divided by song. That, ladies and gentlemen, is how she earned <laughs> the Super Swing Pillow. Super. Second to only a Tony Award, I, mean, I feel. That's from our um, costume assistant, Hannah. She worked on the London company and came here, and she made me that. And I do sleep on it. Can you see my drool? Little drool stain? Yeah, right there. I do sleep on it. Drool stain. Broadway (laughs) Um, drool. Broadway drool. Broadway dreams. Talent. Um, (laughs) So, yeah, that's how I do it. But, I mean, um, Eric, um, one of our other swings in our dance captain, he likes to look at charts. He has to see charts. And I like to see it more sort of, like, written. Written out. Yeah, written out. And then you have your backstage traffic and your backstage choreography. Which in this show is almost more important than the onstage choreography. Because you could get a slot machine on your head or a tranny tramp sling on your feet. A tranny tramp sling. I don't think that's a word. I think I meant <laughs> trampling. Trannies trampling. Ten trampling trannies. Ten trampling trannies. We should write like trampling. a new Dr. Seuss. I think. Ten trampling trannies. Tapping on your toes. That's like a, a, a theater exercise. Right? Almost. I think we should coin it. <laughs> so Coined. Three gray geese, it's ten trampling trannies, trannies tapping on, on your toes. toes. I like it. So yeah, so you have to have your harmonies, your choreo, and your backstage traffic, and your, co- like, you know, backstage traffic, costume traffic, Who, which dresser you go to, which do you put on first, your wig or your costume? So it's, can I say the F word? Oh, we can beep it. It's a say clusterfuck. It. <laughs> it's a total, total clusterfuck. And not only costumes, wigs, and shoes aplenty, but you have to do makeup changes in the show. Yes. Very quick makeup yes. changes in the show. Makeup changes, yes. Especially 
the bar wench track and the Asian girl because Broadway magic. I'm not Asian. I just play one on Broadway. So <laughs> <laughs> when I go on for um, JLA and I do a little makeup edge, yeah, there's makeup, there's lipstick, we put glitter, there's glitter just flying. Everywhere. There's just like clouds of glitter Everywhere. backstage. We should actually take shots of the floor of it, just glitter. Just, there is, because there's just, I mean, look at this. This is how we take our glitter off. Rolls of tape. So we have all this glitter on our lips. This is from your lips. Oh, yeah, that's from our lips. See? And That's then, from her lips. And then we, because we, when we have to take it off, so then we, we kiss the glitter, and we take it like that. That and sounds we, painful. It is painful. It, like, sort of, like, knocking over your <laughs> it sort of um, rips off your skin. And then you do this, kiss, 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 and you roll it up, and then you have just glitter carcasses. You are a mother, I see. Your adorable daughter. Oh, who? That old thing? That old thing came I out of this tiny little, um, tiny little woman. Where, yeah. Have um, this is her. I'll do this. Just for the spotted audience, I'm pulling my dressing room apart. That's my baby girl. So adorable. She's preciosa. Um, she's very precious. She actually, her toys are in here. I have like her books and her toys. Cause sometimes you have to bring your daughter to the theater. <laughs> your dressing room is kind of like your um, you know. Broadway Apart apartment, a Broadway apartment. Little in, in sensible Mitchell. Broadway apartment. It's 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 huge. It's huge. You James. can totally live here. It's huge. There's plenty of room. I could have like six kids in here. She has a full kitchen. <laughs> Broadway's private chef. A bidet. A bidet. <laughs> well, Broadway's bidet. Broadway's gold-plated <laughs> palace bidet. <laughs> James the intern is so funny. I would love a gold-plated bidet. I don't know what I would use it for, but I would... Well, you use it for what you use it the day for. But I think you could use it for other uses. I think you could find... If you had one, you, don't you like, feel like... But the water goes up, so you can't, like, wash your <laughs> face. You'd be like... <laughs> you could try. You could try. <laughs> could be a foot bath, perhaps. A little sensible gold-plated foot bath. <laughs> so we do have a gift for you. A what? Yeah, I know. Spotted. Fancy. Oh gosh, is because it a t-shirt? Uh, it's not a t-shirt okay. though. So we got you Eucerin Plus Sensitive Foot Repair Cream. Because you are going from one show in Crazy High Heels to another show in Crazy High Heels, and we figured your feet might need some relief. Oh, that's so sweet. Clinically proven effective for rough cracked feet. Rough cracked feet, which there are none because we have a gold plated foot bidet. That's 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 my commercial face. That's good. Is it good? It Do you think good. that was good? I think it was really good. Like, do you think would I you? I think you would sell like tens of units. Would you want you'd want to buy Eucerin if I was like selling it? I would buy Eucerin if you were selling it. Thank you. Just like. But like a slow like. Yeah. Did you ever see that YouTube video of the woman who was a hand model? No. Okay. I don't know. Okay. Seriously, I'm like, I have no life and I'm obsessed with YouTube and all things YouTube. I mean, I do have a life. I have a two and a half year old. But um, YouTube creepy woman hand model. Like, pause right now and YouTube creepy woman hand model. She, like, wears these. She's a hand model. That's all she does. She's the one who's like this on the commercial, right? And she wears these long black gloves to go anywhere. Because she can't have, like, the sun staining it. She can't have a chip nail. She can't, please, just, will you do that for that me? That sounds, that sounds too wow. intense. Are you putting this on my... Just a little try. Oh, I can feel it working. Broadway magic. <laughs> this is so good. This will make me swing so much better. Have you seen the show, James? I am seeing the show. I have not seen it yet. So my question was, have you seen the show? No. I have to edit 